Hey folks, I'm Daily Fix and welcome to the Warlord campaign. So we did do the um the Del Basta mission uh last episode and I actually ran a poll on Discord and we're slowly going to be moving towards uh the Genesis mission. Now of course I, I need to go back to the POS because uh we have an intruder. And, and we will, we will, uh, but just not right now. Uh, because I want to prepare a tiny bit for the uh, Genesis mission, and that means that I need another ship. Uh, I don't want to do that particular mission with just uh, the medium ship. Uh, I know that you need to sometimes dock up some places, so going with a small would potentially be the best decision i'm quickly checking out all my stations and we are horribly shy on turret components very very shy i think right now yeah we we just do not have all of these 108 large plasma turrets now that is funny i am going to really enjoy it when any ship comes in range. That is one thing that I do want to do when these turrets become operational. And that is getting this uh, Jaguar on a repeat order picking up drops. The fleet then can move out. I also got the Buffalo and we transported the captain that we got from the Wyvern over to this one. And he is now going to be doing uh, mimicking Commander behavior on the alpha. Uh, what are you actually trading in? Yeah, this is this is fine. Hopefully, it will make us a lot of uh, monies. Uh, is he still set up correctly? The family Zin is over there. Um, that means three jumps. One, two, three. One, two, three. Uh, one, yeah, of course. One, two, three. So Uday in theory. Well, it's not in theory. They are actually able to uh, supply up to uh, my POS. Uh, what's this boa doing? And why are you damaged? Oh yeah, the hull was 73. So we were actually surprised about seeing a boa going through uh, Morning Star 3. So if anything, we need to go into Global Orders. And... Yeah, this is only like Xenon for... They, they, they cannot go into Xenon territory. We're going to be changing the sector activities um, and sector travel. Activities is that they cannot perform actions, but they would still be able to travel through them. I think it would actually be better if we just... Ref uh, just make sure that they are unable to get into territories belonging to enemies. So we're going to be saying all civilian ships. So sector travel and we'll do uh, civ. And uh, because of that, then I know it's only civil as uh, the, the civilian ships. And then um, owned by enemies. We'll just do that. Uh, restrict all factions. Uh, that's not really necessary. You can actually remove it like this. Confirm those changes. This actually does tell them to not go into hostile territory. Uh, do I trust that? No, I kind of don't. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't. I do not. Uh, let's go with the Argon Federation like this. Just, just, just to be on the safe side. That means that activities, which, oddly enough, I actually had my civilian ships. I kind of think we need to remove this. I do want my military ships to get into hostile positions because, well, they're militarized vessels. If I give them the command, they need to do it. So we'll, we'll actually remove that. Uh, so that blacklist is gone. This is the private, private. The Okay, so the trade rule is for the stations. The blacklist is for the ships. 
just so you know, because you know, I, I could actually understand what people like saying, um, what are you doing? What are you doing? So this is, I cannot, I have my ship straight, I think I'm saying that correctly. I need to check that before I mm, speak out of my ass, so to speak. Uh, trade restrictions and sector activity. Yeah, okay. Well, I think it is the way I tell it. If not, then um, let me know in the comment section. I actually got a few names for the station. And we are actually going to be using them. Um, because I was planning to call this the monster. Um, but I actually got some cool suggestions. Uh, one of the, 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 the Hungry Tube or the Logistical Spile. Uh, I'm going to be calling this one the Hungry Tube because I think it's hilarious. Um, rename the Hungry Tube. And I'm going to be calling the Open Market. Um, I'll just add an X. So it's down at the bottom. And then the other factory, we're going to be calling the logistical spiral. Eventually, we're going to be using these two stations to be like the same. So we know the hungry tube is this one. The logistical spiral is in the three families. Now, I'm also building another rattlesnake. And that will probably be called like open wounds because that's a fun name. Uh, and, and keep those names up, guys. I, I really appreciate it when people send me names. Like, they uh, just just help me in the thinking process. Speaking of that, the thinking process, I would really appreciate it if you... If you haven't already, like, like uh, liked, subscribed stuff, you know, YouTube stuff. Because I noticed there is not a lot of interaction on the videos anymore. And that is a bit sad to see. Uh, we're also building... Yeah, I'm thinking, yeah, we were going for the Claytronic production and eventually, yeah, bef I'll expand on this business when we need to because we really are shy turret components for a defensive structure over here and that means as long as we cannot defend this station, well, these rattlesnakes are going to be remaining there. Uh, I also had to dock up this ship and... I'm just going to... Can I teleport over there? I cannot. Uh, we need to quickly bypass some of these stations. Uh, can I go here? Yeah, I can. And then... I don't think I can actually move all the way over here. Although save, of course. Uh, we need to increase my teleportation range. It is a joke and a half and it's annoying and it just saves me so much time if I can jump like five. Uh, right now I cannot. I should actually... Actually, no, that's fine. The reason I'm here is because of the mineral ship we got, it actually has a mod and that is, is actually not ideal. Because I cannot sell it. Uh, I want to sell the ship. I have plenty of uh, mineral miners. I don't think he's actually in it. Okay, what kind of mod do you have on you? He says there is a particular mod. Oh, it's a paint mod. I should not have... You know, it's a disposable unit. Let's go with the default. It looks cool. It's not really helping me at the moment. So, yeah. Installing a new pain mod will destroy the current. Yeah, it, it's fine. It, it's fine. I, I need to sell the ship. I don't care mu that much about those modules anyways. Let's upgrade and... Ooh, let's upgrade and repair. It still has it. Um, wait, is it going to do it right now? Uh, that can wait, yeah. Wait, I think I might have messed that up. Yeah, I did. Default. Install. There you go. It's a shame that they actually get destroyed. I wish that that was not the case. To be fair. I did sell the Navarium. We have actually some very good crew on this ship. Which we... Before we do anything... Wait, there's still a modification on the ship? No way. I just... I removed that. Oh, there is a shield capacitor and there is traveling capacitor. You know, it sounds nice. Who the hell are you? Go away. That's good, dude. But go away. I'm busy. Um...
Uh, dismantle. We should actually get those things back. I do not want to install that. Wait, are these installed? No modifications installed. Okay. And dismantle that. Okay, okay, okay. Can we can we actually sell it now? Uh, let us save the crew. Can I send you... I'll send you over to our trading ship for now. Transfer crew. Veteran Marines. Those guys. Those guys. And those guys. Uh, because I do not... Ha I don't think I have the space. And I do not. No, I don't. So at least we'll uh, we'll save those crew members. Uh, let's get dismantling this. Should be able now. Minimum preset two and a half million. That is fine. Let's continue that, and then we'll sell the ship. And we're going to be ordering another gas miner because the hungry tube is absolutely hungry, and it feels like we're going down on the liquids. Um, Storage levels last day. Yeah, that doesn't look good. So helium is stabilizing. Hydrogen is slowly going up there. Methane still going down. Uh, where's ore? Can we... Can we... Oh, wait. We, you can only have four. That is such... I don't know how I feel about that. I wish we can just add as many as I wanted. Uh, that's actually stabilizing as well. So eventually... It's stabilizing because we're out of room. Look, ore, silicon, they're currently mining that. They're working with that new um, beta update, but this is, methane is too low. Uh, we're using more per hour than it's delivering, and, and that's a problem. So, yeah. Um, you're currently busy. Let's up by the ship, and then we'll uh, immediately... Uh, get another other ship uh, for the genesis mission guys uh let's buy a small i'm hoping chimera no not the basic fighter come on and definitely not with these weapons i like the chimera a lot but you can see that we're, we're missing a lot of things uh but that's fine uh fine and actually don't need a marine can always make this service crew member a marine we need nav beacons, I think. Let's add some of these, some resource probes. Just for the fun of it. Don't think I need any of those. Uh, weapons. Yeah, I'm going really simple on this ship, guys. It's going to be tau accelerators only. Uh, it's my uh, my go-to weapons. I know we can have like 20 missiles on it. It would actually not be a bad idea to add one missile. Yeah. Why? Why would we? Why would we? Combat engines. Yeah, the speed is what I want. I just need... You know, when your base speed is higher than anything else, you can outrun them really easily. So, uh, if you have a name for the Chimera, let me know. Let's confirm that. Uh, it's not going to be built right away. The river and gas is being done. You are currently stripped. And then, yeah, this captain, I, I, yeah, I'm sorry, maybe you're going down with the ship. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. It shouldn't take too long. Shouldn't. Doesn't say it won't. Come on, man, give me some weapons on this. A hundred... Oh, wow. That's perfect. A hundred and thirty-two. I'm thinking construction is going to be done. It's it's just... Oh, man. Um, what were we researching? We are not researching. That's a dumb thing to do. Please gather the required materials. Yeah, that shouldn't be too much a problem. We might need to get a miner to do 50 Neverium. 
uh, we could actually just order that up. With the plasma conductors, I do not have. The advanced electronics I have. I, at least I think I don't have the plasma conductors. Let's take a look. Uh, do we have plasma conductors on this? Uh, we actually do have plasma conductors, so uh, that's fine. Uh, let us order one of the mining ships. Uh, it's not going to be you, mate, because I'm, I'm selling you. Let's not attack that wolf. That's done. What what did I just sell? Oh, wow, for a moment I, I thought I sold the wrong ship. Let us get the Helldiver 1. Where are you currently? You're over here, equipment dog. That's good. I want you to upgrade. And we're going to be adding a high preset that will definitely change how he's behaving. You don't need combat engines. Mark 3. I will keep the 2. That's 2. Uh, we'll get combat engines, better shields, and then the mining drill. Yeah, mining drill. He is going to be mining the Navarium for Commander. We're no longer going to be using him as a Black Ops uh, ship. We haven't used him in a long time. So he'll, he'll be fine. Add that to Q. Confirm that order. And then I'm going to be adding you to the POS. Yeah, that will be good. Uh, the Weverin is done. Let me quickly add you to the Hungry Tube. Mindful Commander Beta. We'll just take a look on how things uh, will go. And can I make my way towards the POS? Milkman, where are you? Wretched skies, huh? Okay, I want you to dock up over there. Dock and wait. And proceed with current orders. No, it's fine. You should be going. Let me quickly get over there. Entering system. Family Zin. Entering system. Wretched skies. So as long as I do not have the Chimera, I uh, will be Heretics using the Milkman. Alright, let's go. Science Laboratory. Quickly, come in. I cannot be sure, but it seems like we have an intruder. Perhaps some long dormant entity has awoken inside this facility. Or maybe beings from the parallel realm have found a way through. Sorry to disappoint. It's just little old me. Don't look so shocked. I should be the one who's surprised to see you running this place, of all people. Intruder, would you be so kind as to take two steps back so that I can enact the purge protocols? And you, dear Vora. Okay, subtitles gone. Approached me to track you down. Luckily for you, I find I think this one that's on me. Troublesome. Yeah, it was on me because I apparently I turned off my heart. Uh, what happened After to you? The situation worsened. My ship was targeted. We didn't have no much way. Of a chance, and only a handful of us managed to escape in our pods. Once I was sure the survivors were safe, I started to piece together what happened. Yeah. yeah. Reen turned herself in to the Argon police. I think that's a smart she choice because she was absolutely useless. In Argon space. It appears that she didn't follow my instructions closely enough. It does. It, it appears. No, she didn't. The conduct of criminal madmen is not much of a plan at all. If you observe something long enough, you can account for anything, even madmen. I started to hear rumors of a mysterious station appearing out of nowhere. Given that I just lost my pride and joy, I was looking for a new start. So I broke in. I was expecting to sweet-talk some top-secret government folks, but everything led to the Boron. And you? You are an interloper. I'm the best damn interloper this side of the multiverse. With my analytic abilities, your resources, and the Boron's prickly demeanor, we can do anything. What do you <laughs> say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's give it a try. I'll start measuring this room up so I can get my equipment in. You will do no such thing. This is my laboratory. You'll hardly know I'm here. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Anyhow, uh, so uh, the milkman should be on its way. Could I just teleport over here? I don't think that is going to be the case, huh? Ooh, I can't even, I can't even teleport to it. I can't even select the ship. Uh, deliver 10 units of antimatter cells. How would we know? 
Uh, well, that is good to know anyways, uh, but we're almo almost there. So we might... Do I have antimatter cells on the station? I do not. Let's teleport towards the milkman. Because that flight is a bit too much if I have Entering to go, like, use my spacesuit to get to the, um, the Orberf, I think it's called, what's it called, it's called again? Uh, the Orberf, yeah. Alright, let let's me assume command right end. now. Thank you. Don't mind that he is, um, is having the order to... How do you say it? Like, get to the POS, because then at least he is in a safe position. Let's go there. Can't click on it. Okay, there you go. Research. And then we'll talk to uh, the professor. Yeah, docking should not be possible, but we'll try it anyways. Docking not possible. Sunder, gas, vanguard. Yeah, I don't care about the Sunder gas vanguard. Okinawa, research. Okinawa, it says the orb of... So we might be marooned uh, by my dear rattlesnake. 400 meters is just a bit too much. Come on. Docking not possible. Man. Dragon. Docking granted. Yep. All right, let's talk to uh, the dear professor over here. Greetings. I am Dr. Rick Feynman, chief scientist of the Oberth and in charge of Project Genesis. Our research vessel is currently observing anomalies and gravimetric shears in this region. That's sad. Immediately I know that it's Project Genesis. Oh, it's just part of our gravimetric studies. For now, it's just a mass of data from our sensors, but we'll publish our research once it is concluded. Anything else? Uh, how long will it take? We are currently lacking antimatter cells to complete our observations. If you can organize a delivery to this vessel, we'll be able to greatly advance our timetable. Okay, and for that we actually do need a small ship. We could use the Jaguar or one of the uh, Xenon ships. Which one's nearest? He's in family zone. I think we'll use him. Let's go over here. We'll need 10 antimatter cells. We should actually have antimatter cells. Do I not have antimatter? Oh, I do. Here we go. Alright, 10 of you. Confirm that. And I'll send him to... Uh Transfer West? No, I'll just ask him to teleport and I'll uh, jump over. Okay, so I decided to cancel the Crimera's production, uh, basically because, well, we got one of these ships still, and I quite like the look of these. Might as well just go and use a ship that we actually took from the Xenon. Because why not, right? So let me get a few, few screenshots. I don't know for potential thumbnail ability. Anyways, let's go. So yeah, uh, this way we don't have to, well, spend about eight million, and we could actually order up. How badly are you getting shot? Not that badly, actually. We can order up another rattlesnakes. I wanted a group of five. And I think that with a group of five, it is going to be possible for us to start 
really putting pressure on the Argon Federation, especially Guiding Star 4 or 5. The reason I want to target Guiding Star 5 first is there is nothing mineable in Guiding Star 7. And the same goes for the 11th hour. So taking out their supply and hopefully eventually building a defense place in here would actually be um, quite nice. What it also will or can do in the future is that the Patriarch is going to be expanding into these, which I would really appreciate because, well, why not, right? More stations, more trade, more opportunities for us to um, have some fun with that. But a group of five, I think, should in theory be enough to deal with the defensive station. Let me check that real quick. Well, that might be a bit too for you. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 defensive structures. Unfortunately, I don't really... Well, it kind of depends on which way we'll come into. I guess. Like, if you come from above, you'll be really hammered. But if you could come in from a point like over here just start shooting that and just oh yeah oh my five might be a bit too few though at least five is way better than the amount i'm currently having and uh, yeah let us quickly make sure that we order up another rattlesnake uh, dead on arrival, confirm that, advanced excellence weapon comp yeah, it's just the selling, I'm not sure, I'm not sure why they're not going out of their way to buy from the hungry tube, we're making a good amount of money, I just transferred like 7 million over, so don't be alarmed by this, here you go, 7 million, uh, we were making about 6 million with this station, and if we get those 4 modules on all of it, it's, it's going to be quite, uh, Nice, so two rattlesnakes, and we still have some uh, money left over, which I quite like to play around with. Anyhow, let us take command and trade the antimatter cells. Right, let's get up. I think this ship, using this ship, would actually... This is an elevator. Holy... It is so... I didn't even know that. Oh, that makes sense. Well, okay. <laughs> like I said, this is one of the first times I'm actually using these ships. I used them to pick up um, stranded uh, troops in the past. But, yeah, nothing much out of that. This is the bridge or brick. I didn't... I think this is the break. Yeah. Let's not go there right away. Greetings. We're still waiting for antimatter cells to complete our observations. It seems the Terrans, or maybe even the station's current occupant, are obstructing any deliveries to block our progress. No. If you can organize a delivery, please do so. It will greatly advance our timetable. Dude, we... We did that. Our... Team, thank you for your fast travel. Unable to dog by the milkman. Yeah, I'm going to be using the uh, milk. Need your help in putting this antimatter to good use. We You're joking. Need ships at the specified locations to initiate a synchronized long-range scan. We will be enlisting, but if you have any friends who can join us, now would be a good time to ask them along. Okay, we need freeze. Okay, that's that's quite a few. One is going to be us. Fly there. This boa. Fly here. And we'll take the will first they be point. Able to use those traces? Constructing the events of the electrical discharge. Nav beacon. I should actually show the weapons a bit. And they're called the needle. Apparently they shoot needles. 
which are also armor piercings. I did look at the encyclopedia, and apparently that's like a a 40... Um, make a jolt attack. Uh, show encyclopedia. Uh, so we'll do 40 and 40. I, I think it's fine. Um, not sure if that's good or not. I love how you can look at this. Like silicon or energy cells. And then a whole bunch of difficultiness. But if you're the Xenon, all you need is a system with ore, silicon, and a sun. And you'll be golden. I think that's still cool though. But it seems a bit too easy. Uh, let me wait for my ships to arrive. Uh, we are going to be at the designated location. It looks like you're positioning your ship. The synchronized scan. Please try to be precise. We don't want junk readings cluttering up our database. Mm -hmm. Once you initiate the scan from your ship, the other captains will follow your lead. Very good. There we, we are go. receiving the data stream. We've got what we were after. Thank you for your support. That's fine. Oh, I'm hit, please. We're far from home, short on hands, and have additional tasks which need doing. If you're interested, please meet me on our ship. All right, let's go. Yeah, it, it's so much easier when you're using a ship like this. The one thing that I want to take a quick look is... Would I be able to... Upgrade the ship, so to speak? So let, let me get out of the command position. Otherwise, not really able to use... The upgrade and repair. If Man. we can upgrade him. Oh, they only have combat engines mark one. Yeah, they're, they're not fast. They're not fast though. Strafing speed, that would be quite nice having that upgrade. Yeah, we picked up those two crew members. We'll eventually use them. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's get back into the command position. And let's fly over there. I was considering for a moment just to add a trader to the defense base. But I think if we mess around too much, Auto. then... Engaged. The Patriarch will stop building ships. Now I'm actually seeing small ships again. And it was for the longest time that that wasn't really a thing. Like I saw a rattle. Is it the rattle? No, it's not a rattlesnake. It was a, a raptor without any subordinates. And, and I think that is because I Auto might have been trying to just get my okay, ships out uh, fast. Research. And just giving them a bit of time to prepare, I think they might actually get the the upper hand docked. with um, with the Xenon again. Oh, I love this elevator though. Okay, say say that while I stock immediately. Let's go to the bridge, Mister Doctor Rick Freeman. Greetings. Losing access to our research facility was what prompted this expedition. Now we have not only located our facility, but also taken precautions. If it disappears from under our noses again, we won't have such a hard time tracking it down. Uh, okay, what's your plan? We've prepared some software which will help us regain access, but our ship isn't really inconspicuous enough to plant it on our station. The malware should be subtle enough to go unnoticed by the current occupant. It will be your job to plant it at this location, identified by our analyst. According to the annotation on the station plans, there should be a signal leak next to what looks like either a valve or a window. But you'll find out when you get there. Um, okay, I guess. Let's scan the POS. So, whenever we get the, uh, the mission... To just get into Terran space. I kind of do want to explore it. See if, um, if we can get some sort of business going. Actually, 
quite like how this is actually starting to look. Um, I'm waiting until I have the high, uh, the high tech modules, all of them. Then I'll add like four of each, and then I will add whatever it needs. So this is definitely one of those long projects again. I also want to use this in the, in the future for ventures um, as well as building ships. So the station by itself would not be as much used for sales. We'll use the other station for that. And for that, we actually need, I, I need like 120,000 uh, claytronics or something. A ridiculous, ridiculous amount. Uh, let's just get quickly towards the location. Assistant. Oh, you're what joking. In the name of the queen do you think you are doing here? Will this help the vexatious ship to conclude its interfering business? Yeah. Well, I suppose it will. In that case, please be so kind as to infiltrate the station with their malware so that I can take a look at it. Better keep up appearances so as to not arouse suspicion. And if Bozo has it under control, all the better. Okay, so here's the signal leak. Apparently that changed as well, although... I'm not really seeing it. But, I guess... I think I'm a bit too far away. You know, this is what I love about going. You can absolutely just fly through every small area. I love that so much. Okay, let's go back. And I'm hoping that eventually those rattlesnakes will be built. Every time that... A Xenon K jumps in. I am quite anxious about losing my ships because um, they do very much rely on those plasmas. And I've seen them miss. Oh my god, they missed so many times. And yeah, it's that's not what I want. Let's, uh, let's quickly dock up over here. Okinawa, research. There we go. Actually, one of the rattlesnakes is currently being constructed. You are over here. Let's send you over to the split, upgrade and repair. Um, we'll just do this by hand. Otherwise, it will actually remove the Mark II shielding. I don't want that. Uh, because I think they just don't have that. If I go with another preset... Uh, but what I do want is flag, 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 and flag. And that is the only reason they are getting towards the point. And then I will actually just fill in these. So as for a name, let's uh, quickly get my list. So I can copy paste. This is going to be open wounds. There we go. And queue that up. Uh, next one is... Paul of Family, probably. And then that leaves me three names. So, yeah, that ship's going to be busy for a while. The other one is still not being built. Oh, well. Okay, let's get up and do the mission. Yeah, let's just get on this bridge. See if that goes way easier. Yeah. Way easier. Instead of jumping doom. What is it now? What? 
What is it now? Um, Sir, the Boron gave me this. What is this? He he gave you our research? Unbelievable. Yeah, because you yeah, he's better at the job there. than you guys. How are. did that happen? Ah, uh, it, it's my station. I clearly underestimated this Boron and his capabilities. This means we can continue with Project Genesis. It is our uttermost. And he's immediately setting we course. Not make an enemy of the Boron, so we'll leave him in possession of our station for the time being. We'll have to come back better prepared if we want to recover our station. Wow. I didn't think we'd make progress this fast. Regardless, we could do with a little more of your assistance. You'll be helping one of our associates in acquiring research that is vital to Project Genesis. Uh, okay. An independent scientist. Let me contact them. Oh. Greetings. We are sending you the pilot you request. Ah, uh, is this creature qualified? Yes. No, no, don't worry. This one's at least a two-star pilot. Expecting her on the experiment site. Okay, she is heading your way. That's settled. Report to Kuramankami. They are experimenting with a phenomenon in the void and will instruct you on your part once you get there. This may seem unconnected at first, but rest assured, you are helping mold our future. It seems that you are missing crucial spacesuit equipment. No. Take this with you. It will be useful later on. Wait, what? I shouldn't I should have everything actually. Oh no, maybe not the um I think you might actually not have the bomb launcher. What is it exactly that they're trying to achieve? They are hoping to colonize a planet as a new home for their people. The Terrans once meddled with such terraforming technology, which resulted in the creation of the Xenon. Let us hope that the Sigara's pioneers are not repeating their mistake. Yeah. Okay, so currently we are heading out. And it seems the scale plate back station over here is being assaulted. Okay, before I forget, uh, these need to be removed. And you need to be removed. And I have the... Uh-oh. Did I lose the ship already? No, it's not. It is here. He is currently... I set it to mine. And he should be full of Neverium. He's going to the POS, dropping the 50 Neverium, and we are still shy. The plasma conductors and the advanced electronics, you know, which is fine. We're going to be beelining the teleportation range all the way up until we can uh, transport the station. And I was thinking, uh, but let me know on Discord or in the comment section, uh, which... Planet we should start with. We could go with the Taladi one, the Memory of Profit, which gives us uh, a way to get uh, four-star pilots, which really would benefit us uh, because we could actually set up more trading ships quite easily. We could also use four-star captains for our battleships, which makes them more effective. And yeah, we should... Get production module Enter. hacking, Enter. habitational Enter. storage stuff. That we we need to get that done. For now, we should head over to the void. Uh, once I check um, how my relationship with the Antigon is. Uh, negative 15. Well, they're not going to be targeting my combat ships. Oh, that, that's not the Terrans. The Terrans are a negative 15 as well. But the Pioneers are at plus 9. Now, I think that the Terrans do connect to this region by some Xenon, uh, some Xenon systems. Uh, but I don't remember the really... I know I'm 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 on board there, the Bor Bosa. Is no longer cloistering itself behind that peculiar radiation. Well done, assistant. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's go deep into hostile territory again. Uh while my milkman is over here, we're gonna be shooting the crap out of this storage. I need it to go away. Unfortunately, I cannot give him the command to attack build sites. I wish that that was added. 
Because sometimes if, if, if another faction is building a station, having the option to destroy the build storage is hilarious. Because they would not have materials anymore. And making them pay more for those materials or having to ship them over, I think is... Um, would be a very, very clever idea of um, kind of crippling them, I guess. Uh, shield components are being delivered. Third components, advanced components are not. Yeah. If I also build... Let me think a bit. Um, if I continue the construction over, the, over here, the heart of acrimony, would that be a smart idea? Uh, we're currently in here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Personally, if if we can rebuild this over here, but defend that from uh, Matrix Nine because there's going to be ships heading in there, I think it would be. Quite easy because they could actually trade amongst each other while also keep trade up. This station would actually be able to trade with the Patriarch. And I'm hoping that is actually going to be happening then. While also trading, of course, with the free families and eventually, I don't know, the, the, the Taladi. I think the Taladi is at, yeah, plus nine, uh, 11. Yeah, they're at 11. That's not bad. Uh, just nine more points and we can get a trade subscription, which is quite interesting for my money. Uh, do we have that from the three families? I do. And yeah, that's kind of no problem. Yeah, I think I will, if we're going to be building that station, I'm saying if. Can I, could I check? Oh, we are just dead in space. That's smart. In can I check? He is not being built. Could I see how much? Goods are in. That's too complete. Yeah, I wish that there was an option for us to see how many resources that would be. Also, if I'm going to be using like this design of a station for more, then we're going to be changing the way this is set up. And that would mean that I would start from the lower tiers, like sun, and then go uh, refined metal, silicon wafers, Entering graphene, and then choice. going all the way to high tech. So there's a logical way for us to build. Unfortunately, that also would mean that it will take a long time for the station to be built. We could also say, well, I'll focus on getting Claytronic. So the station could actually assist in its construction, like hull parts energy because that's the three main components and then go into weapon components while we use one of our fleets and i'm saying one of our fleets because by the time that is happening i'm hoping to get more ships like i said man this this playthrough might be a while uh, i have no reason to stop um at any given point uh because we can just continue the split warlord doesn't only involve warring the Xenon and the Argon Federation. Entering we system. might just go for a galactic domination. Not sure yet. Um, but yeah. Uh, while we go towards the void, I'll, when we get there, I want to go to the Pioneer Space so I can actually dock the ship up. Autopilot. Entering system. Second contact. Okay, right, let's, uh, let's get the heck out of here before something notices me, and I don't want that. Uh, where's the station? Of the, uh, the gate. Should be somewhere around, uh... At least get safe.
there's a station, there's a object, there's an object. So this one will go into Xenon territory, I believe. And this one will go to where we actually need to go. I think... Elite Vanguard. Yeah, those those Federation guys, they think they rule every damn system, don't they? This could also be very well be completely to taken over by... Uh, system, the Void. Yeah, by the Xenon. Luckily for me, that's not the case. The problem here is there is... Well... That area to my right is hazardous and... Yeah. That will harm my shit. Actually, this is already has this. Can I just get by it? Danger. Hazardous region detected. And so far, it just messes with my shields. Wait, did they change that where it only messes with your shields? It's possible, though, that I just missed the, uh, the update on that. I'm going to somewhere... And, oh, of course, yeah. No, this is where the pilot is. This is where I need to mess around. Let's head over to the pioneers. Because I don't Jumping. think these... Unknown. Yeah, no, these these Unknown. are Antigon. Should they will not let me do... Oh, this is actually the Argon Federation as well. Entering system. Antigone Memorial. Yeah, okay. Uh, that means that we need to go somewhere to the left... Uh, we could use the gate, uh, which actually would be a very smart choice. Uh, that, I think, in the distance. Yeah, that's good to know. We need to go a bit more to the right. I love the zooming option. It's so good. Yeah, love that. So once I'm there, we'll, we're going to be docking up. And I'm actually... I, I want to do a quick fly through all of the Terran systems as well. Even though they're at negative 15. If I can do the hunt for criminals. Like by myself. At least um, we'll have some more progress done. Yeah, I hate it when this happens. You know, and my station is just... Without missiles, without any ways of defending themselves. I hate that. And there's X. Look at this. There is another one. See that to the left? Yep. They're everywhere. Entering system. Sigaris. And there is the dock I was hoping to see. So we're in Sigaris space. And we're amongst at least... A species that kind of likes me. Of course, the Terrans themselves, they don't like anyone, but they're Terrans. Unknown station. So we'll dock up over with the equipment dock. And that is where we ended off, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. Um, it's a bit different. Now I'm doing missions uh, and stuff, but it's uh, it's better to for me to do missions instead of having the game run for such a long time and nothing happening. That is really demotivating for me. So I do hope you enjoy the change. And docking yeah. Granted. I didn't mean docking to turn off my heart. There we go. Anyways, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.